Hey guys, Minecraft Fox here, and today I'm going to show you how to make a um, bowling mini game type of thing out of uh, redstone and ice and some other stuff. So uh, the very first thing you're going to want to do, which I've already done here so you didn't have to watch me dig, is to make a um, one deep hole basically um, anywhere in the ground is where I have it, but uh, as long as it's one deep, you're good. Um, you're going to want it six spaces across, or uh, not across, but um, in depth. And across you can have as, as many as you want. Um, to simplify this tutorial, I'm going to do a four pressure plate um, bowling game. Um, it'll just make it easier. Having an even number is easier, and um, the less, less of them you do, it's, it's easier. But uh, anyway, the first thing you're going to want to do after you dig your hole is you're going to want to fill the, uh, the hole you dug with some ice. Okay, so you should have uh, something like this. And the reason you make it six, six spaces this way is because the seventh space here is where you'll put your pressure plates. Um, when you throw an object like from there, oops, well, if it gets on the ice anyway, it, it can only go seven spaces. So this is the seventh space here. It can't go any farther, so um, if you make it longer, your bowling game's not going to work. But uh, go ahead and put oops, some blocks down here. And okay, so this is where our pressure plates are going to be. This right here is where people are going to stand to... Uh, throw objects. So I'm going to go ahead and put some glass right here. After you get all of this done, you're going to want to go ahead and every other space put up a two block. Yeah. Two block pillar. Oops. Actually, I made this one one too big. Um, you're going to want it to where there's two pillars um, on the end, and every other one there should be a uh, hole, like that. So you want something that looks like this, okay, and you want wooden pressure plates. Um, the stone ones, as far as I know and have tested, do not work um, with items on top of them, only the wooden ones. Um, the stone ones seem to only work for players. But uh, in these little gaps right here, you'll put your uh, pressure plates. Okay. So you'll have something that looks like this. All right. And this is pretty much the, um, the framework for the game. You can go ahead and make it nicer by putting your, your walls up here. And uh, you can use any block you want. It doesn't have to be stone for redstone or, or the pressure plates or anything. Um, you can't put them on ice, so you can't have an ice block there. But uh, I'm pretty sure you can use snow or, or you know, whatever. So now we're going to want to wire these pressure plates up. And to do that, you just take some uh, redstone dust here put it on these. Okay. And now since these are close together, it it'd be easier if you left two two gaps. Um, but since these are close, you're gonna want to bring them bring them out. And I'll show you why you want to bring them out in a second. Okay, so you're gonna want something like this when you're done with the uh, the redstone wiring and the, the pressure plates. And the reason for this is because you're going to want AND gates. And what AND gates are is when all four of these are on, you're going to want to um, to win the game. Or uh, you can hook them up to a dispenser. Um, you could do anything. So you're going to want an AND gate so that when all of them are on, you win, not just like one of them. Um, you could do it uh, where each one's a different thing. 
but I guess that's a, a another video. But um, anyway, so to make an AND gate, for example, you'll want to put a block here and a block here. So you want three blocks. The uh, two inputs are going into these blocks. Redstone wire powers the block that it's pointing into. You'll, the, the two inputs that you have, you'll want two torches up there. So, and these are redstone torches um, above the blocks. You'll want to connect them with a redstone wire. Okay. And then in the middle here, put that. And that will be your, uh, your output wire. Um, and what it means is when these two torches are on, this doesn't receive any power. Uh, when redstone torches receive power, they can't give any power. So, in order to turn it on, you have to give these two torches power. And hitting this, this pressure plate right here is going to give power to the torches, and therefore letting that one turn on. And um, if you didn't understand all that, I'll uh, show you in a second here. I get these done. Stupid chickens all over the place. So you should have uh, your two two AND gates here. And now you're just going to want to uh, link them. So I'll take my redstone here. This might not be enough. Oops. Uh, the other thing is redstone can only go 15 blocks. If it goes more than 15 blocks, you have to extend it which is also a pain in the butt to do. Let me test this out here. Okay. Oh, okay, we're good. Okay, but um, see how when these two torches are off now, because these two pressure plates are hit, this one comes on, therefore giving power to this wire right here. And, for example, if one of these is on, but not the other one, it's off. So you're not getting any um, any power right here. Okay, so go ahead and destroy these, and we will want to make a third AND gate. Um, so let me go ahead and do that. All right, now the logic. Get that egg out of the way. The logic for this game is set up. Um, right now, it, it is playable. If you have all four of these on, this will come off. So you'll get a, for example, whoops, see so three of them on. You're still you know, off. Then with this fourth one on, this comes on. So that would be a uh, victory in the game. For example, um, that means you know you got all all four. So you can hook this up right here to anything you want. Um, I think today I'm going to use a dispenser. So let me wire this up over here. And I'm just going to run this to my game. The front part all the way over here. Whoops. I'm going to need an extender for this, but um, I'll do that in a second. Oh, you know what? I know what I forgot to do. Okay. I forgot. You're going to want to make a um area for people to stand over here, like to to throw the uh the bowling balls or eggs or you know whatever you use. And so I'm going to put my dispenser right here. Get a, uh, yeah, a block right there. Okay. Save these. Redstone torches aren't in my um, 
my inventory here. Okay. So I have a dispenser there. And the way this is going to work is it's going to, to power my dispenser here when I um, get all four of these. So let me go ahead and put my... Oops. Go ahead and get all my supplies back so I can finish up this build. Go ahead and just do that. All right. Um, okay, so now that we've got everything set up, we're going to have to extend, extend this here. Uh, let's see. Okay, I'm pretty sure. Whoa, laggy. Uh, pretty sure... Extender. Oops. Uh, oh, pfft, duh. Okay. Sorry about that. Okay, that's an extender there. Okay. this out over here. Oops. Alright. Yep, everything works. So go over here and click this. And let's see. What's a nice prize? How about if I can find it? Oh. How about a cake? cakes in there. Oh, get out of here. Go away. Okay. So now our bowling game should be done. Um, there's a lot of things you can do to hide all this redstone. But again, that's another video for another time. Uh, right now we're just concerned about getting this to work. So I will use um I just keep using redstone. Okay, so ideally when you get all four of these here you should get a cake. Oh, there we go. You want a cake and to reset the uh the game um, there's not an easy way because you have to wait for these items to disappear. So you're just going to really have to run up and, and grab them. And so every time you uh, you play, oops, and you win, you'll get a, a cake. Yay. So anyway, that's a... um. A basic bowling game and uh, you can tweak this in a couple different ways um, as I said again you can hook up the the victory thing or whatever you want to call it to uh, music blocks um, doors dispensers um, pretty much anything you can hide all this underground uh, you can set up more pressure plates less pressure plates you can have bonus ones um, you can light things up, you can do all that, but uh, you can go ahead and get an aerial shot of the basic circuit here. Um, your, two, your three AND circuits go into your extenders, because redstone wire can only go 15 blocks, and up to your dispenser. So anyway, that's a, um, a basic game. If you have any questions, uh, feel free to message me. Uh, more videos coming soon, so be sure to subscribe. And uh, thank you for watching.